Why you mad? I got a bad bro. Name hot in these streets, no Tabasco. But I'm so stuck, that's a fact, yo. And if you think I'm running, you can run it back, yo. Go on, run it back. You know that I run it. Everything you wanna do, I already done it. And I got Yo, what's up guys? I finally decided that it's time to start my Nothing to Something series again. So in this series, we're going to start from zero and I'm going to try to make my way up to at least 20,000 value. I'm going to try to do all of that in one month since I only bought one month of premium. I never finished my last series, so I still have a few items from that one, but I'm going to trade them all to my other account. So this is the item I'm going to be starting with, the new assist burger boost. The wrap is currently 945, so I'm going to see if I can try to make a trade for it. So the way I'm going to start is by using Rolly Mons. This is what I do in all of my Nothing Something series, so I'm just going to show you guys one more time. So basically what I do is I'll look for items that have about the same wrap as mine, but just a little bit more. So you just want to filter, since mine is 945, I'll go for 1050. And I'll just look through all these items and send to owners of a bunch of them. So let me just show you an example. For this Roebling, I'm just going to go to all of the sellers and send all of them trades. Or at least as many as I can. And from here, since I'm sending out so many trades, eventually someone will probably accept. I'm going to do this for a few different items and then I'll come back and see if anyone accepts. So I just got this trade inbound, it's the Nubisys Burger Boost for the Egg Cognito Egg. I think this item might be a little bit projected, but either way I'm still going to accept. Because even if it does drop, I'm not really going to lose much. So I'm just going to take the W and see if I can send some more trades and make more profit with this one. So on this first trade we made about 100 Robux profit. So let's go on to the next one. I'm going to use the same method that I just used where I just send a bunch of trades to different owners. So I think I hit the trade limit actually because now when I try to send a trade, there's an unknown error has occurred. So I'm probably just gonna wait a little bit and see if I can send some trades later or see if one of my trades get accepted. All right, so I'm in trade hangout right now and I'm gonna, okay, I just found somebody with the projected, the projected riptide. So I'm gonna see if he wants to trade for it. I'm gonna send him my only item for it. And if he does accept, that's going to be really big because I'll be able to flip it and hopefully make a lot of profit off of it. Okay, so I was able to complete a trade for the Riptide. I gave the Egg Cognito Egg in 150 Robux, which basically is just the Robux I would have gotten from Premium. So I'm going to count that. And I got the Riptide for it. So I'm going to see if I can get like 2k for the Riptide. And that's going to be a very good profit and a good head start. So I'm going to try my best to get the uh, Sinister Branches. So I'm going to send to anybody I see and trade hang out with them. The main problem with trading at such a small amount is that you have to basically add everyone you want to trade with. I just got this trade inbound. I'm going to accept it. It's the Riptide and some Robux for the Sinister Branches. So now I have the Sinister Branches and about 400 Robux, including the 450 I started with from Premium. 
and the 191 that I just got. So that was a pretty quick flip. I flipped it in like five minutes. So that was really good. Now I'm gonna see if I can possibly get another projected with the sinister branches and make even more profit like that. So I'm gonna spend some time at Trade Hangout, see if I find anybody with projected and I'll let you guys know. So I found this guy with the projected. He has the Aqua Emperor of the Sky. So I'm gonna see if I could send my sinister branches and some Robux for the projected and a small. Okay, so the offer is gonna be sinister and 450 Robux for Aqua Emperor of the Sky and Apple Pie. He said he's gonna send. So if he sends that I'm definitely going to accept so I can flip to projected and then I also have the apple pie. Okay so this is what he sent, sinister and about 100 robux for aqua and apple pie. I'm going to accept that for sure because I was planning on giving more robux so uh, I'm glad that he sent this instead. So hopefully now with aqua I can get at least 2k back and we can move up to about 3k. Okay, so on the first trade I sent, I already flipped the projected. I got the casual sunglasses and the green goof. So let me see how much I have right now. So right now I have 3.6k wrap and I also have about 350 Robux that I can spend. So we're actually doing pretty good. We're already at about 4k. I'm going to see if I can possibly get to 5k by the end of the video or at least make one more trade. So I'm going to look to see if I can find another projected and then hopefully do the same thing again. So before I went to sleep, I decided to send a bunch of mass trades so I would see what I get in the morning. This is one of the trades that I sent. I gave the green goo for the mad scientist here. And I was able to actually get this one completed before I went to sleep. So I was able to send even more mass trades. And I was able to flip this projected mad scientist here. And I flipped it for Rosa May's face, which is 3.8k. So I gained about 2k just off of these two trades, which is pretty crazy. So I'm going to see if I can get a projected for some of my small items or if I can downgrade the Rosa May's face. Alright, so I just found this guy with a projected. He has the Aqua Emperor of the Sky, so I'm going to see if I can send one of my smalls for it and see if he accepts. So I'm going to send the casual sunglasses for it and see what he says to that. He actually said that he wanted me to add some Robux, so I'm going to add some and see if he accepts now. I'm going to add about like 300 and hopefully he takes that. And so he ended up accepting, so hopefully I can flip it and make like 2k off of it. Since I only gave like 1200, that would be ideal. So right after I made that last trade, I was able to give the Aqua Emperor of the Sky, the Rosa Maze face, and the Apple Pie for the DIY Dominus Imperius and the Winter King Crown. The guy was literally right next to me and he just sent it to me. And I instantly accepted. I mean, this is a really good trade. I basically only gave 5.6 thousand for 7,000 since I got the projected for only uh, 1200 so this is a really good trade in my opinion and I'm happy I was able to get rid of the projected so quick. But anyways I think that's going to be the end of the video. We made a ton of trades this video and we went all the way from 800 to about 7000 value which is pretty crazy in my opinion I didn't expect to get there that quick. So hopefully by next episode I'm going to make a few more trades and we'll have a lot of new trades to go over. This is the first trade I completed. I gave the Nubisys Burger Boost for the Egg Cognito Egg. I think since I traded it, it got projected, but that's besides the point. The next trade, I gave the Egg Cognito Egg and 150 Robux for the Riptide, which was projected at the time. And then I gave the Riptide for the Sinister Branches and about 200 Robux. Next, I gave the Sinister Branches and 100 Robux for the Aqua Emperor of the Sky and the Apple Pie. The Aqua Emperor was like about 4k at the time because it was projected. And then I gave the Aqua Emperor of the Sky for the casual sunglasses and the green goo. Next I gave the green goo for the Mad Scientist hair, which is also another projected. Then I flipped the projected for the Rosa Maze face 
which is about 3.8k. So this was one of the biggest trades right here. I gave basically 1700 for 3.8k, which is over 2k profit just on one trade. And then next I gave the casual sunglasses and 300 robux for the aqua ember of the sky, which again is a projected. And then this is the last trade, which I just showed you the aqua ember of the sky, Rosa May's face and uh, apple pie for the DIY Dominus Imperius and Winter King Crown. So I'm really happy we were able to get to 7k and we were able to complete a lot of trades. I spent a lot of time making trades over the past two days. So I hope you guys enjoy the Nothing to Something series. I know a lot of people have been asking for it. So I hope you guys are happy that I brought it back. I'm going to try to be more consistent with it and hopefully get to like 20k by the end of the month. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy, please leave a like and subscribe so I know you guys like these types of videos. Anyway, thanks for watching. Peace.